Hi, my name's Lieutenant Commander Leanne Fullwood and I'm going to give you a short video presentation today on how to use the Tempest Pro and the Tempest LS defibrillator. The main objectives that we're going to cover in this video are how to complete the 373s in accordance with the user manual, we're going to prepare patient monitoring and defibrillator equipment, use the patient monitoring and defib equipment, utilise ECG capability, outline day-to-day -day maintenance of patient monitoring and defib equipment, explain IPC regulations, responding to alarms, identifying and troubleshooting any idiosyncrasies, and demonstrate how to transfer patient data. The Tempest Pro is a multi-parameter vital signs monitor designed for use in pre-hospital and remote locations. Within Defence, it started off as a Role 1 asset and is now used within deployed hospital care and within critical care units. The device also provides the user with the ability to capture patient incident data in electronic format, which provides reachback capability to allow data to be passed from one Tempest Pro to another and enable the patient's record to remain with them as they move from one caregiver to another. During this presentation, we're going to be covering an introduction to the device parameters and its key features. We'll give an overview of the system, navigating the Tempest Pro and the medical parameters that are used within it. OK, so let's talk about the key features of the Tempest Pro. It's, uh, the size of it is a 10 by 8 inch box um, and it weighs 2.9 kilos, which includes the battery and the rapid pack clip on the back of the device. Um, some environmental considerations then, its operational temperatures are between 0 and 50 degrees um, and it does have a short operating time of minus 20 degrees for up to 60 minutes but as long as it's stored at room temperature. Okay so the battery life of the Tempest Pro, it has an operating time of just over 10 hours uh, but can be extended to 14 hours if it's in battery saving mode. It takes about 3 hours to charge to 90% and 4 hours to fully charge at 100%. It has passed the military standards for drop testing, um, so it's a really robust bit of kit, which is why um, this item particularly has been chosen to be used within Defence. Okay, so if we take a look at the Tempest Pro itself, I'm just going to talk you through some of the key features uh, that you can see in front of you. So on the top of the kit there, you've got your carry strap um, with your alarm bar um, at the top with all your different coloured lights, depending on the warning that you're going to get. Um, we've got a speaker here in the top right corner and we've got all the membrane buttons which I'll talk you through later on in the video. Uh, the battery pack is to the rear and um, you've got your touch screen monitor there. Okay, so the battery pack that you can see underneath, um, you just remove it with the two clips and then you can replace it with another battery if needed. Okay, so when we look down the left hand side of the Tempest Pro, I'm going to talk you through all of the different uh, cable connectors that we've got on the side here. All the cables are designed only for the Tempest Pro, so it's really important you've got the right cables. Um, all of these have dust covers on them, which is really important for us, particularly in a military environment, just to protect against moisture and dust. So one of your checks is to make sure that the dust covers are all present and correct. So starting from the top there, we've got our ECG cable, which you can do a three or five lead from. You've got your non-invasive blood pressure, your SATS connector, invasive pressure monitoring, which you can do up to four of, um, end or CO2, and we've got two ports here for the temperature. Um, this little space at the bottom here is your locking mechanism for any wall mount that you're using the Tempest Pro with. So looking down the right hand side of the Tempest Pro, we've got our mains power and our audio port. Um, this switch here pops it into tactical mode, which takes off your alarms and minimises your lighting. Um, this cable here allows you to connect um, to any Ethernet port. And we've got two USB ports, which allows for your data transfer um, and connectivity to other devices. So looking at the top of the Tempest Pro, we've got our translucent handle, which acts as a light bar to provide 360 degree alarm capability. It has an LED alarm indicator on the front, which will flash up as a solid amber, flashing amber or red, depending on the severity of the alarm that it triggers. The top of the Tempest Pro is where the antenna sits for GPS and Bluetooth capability to allow for seamless patient data transfer. 
So looking at the back of the Tempest Pro then, we've got our camera capability, which we'll talk about later in the video. We've got our rear alarm indicator, which sits just at the top there. And all of these little holders um, are for your accessory storage. So you can put your 3 lead ECG cable here, your SATS sensor here, and your non-invasive blood pressure cuff in this compartment here.